to you who sets foot in this shrine. I am that person. Dang, I can't read it all. Magnesis Trial. Okay. Oh, I remember this music. Best. Pretty sure we're gonna unlock the Magnesis thing. It only makes sense. Distilling room? I should definitely learn the language for this game so I can actually read the different things. Magnesis. So let's line that up. M. Magnesis. I'm pretty sure he's like an end character. So yeah. Interesting. Um, rune extracted. Manipulate metallic objects using magnetism. Grab onto metallic objects using the mag magnetic energy that pours forth from the magnetic magnesis rune. Objects held in the magnetic snare can be lifted up and moved freely. Okay, left bumper. Nice. So, why is he walking like that? Okay. Let's lift this up. Whoa, puzzle. Uh, how do I drop it? Cancel. Okay. What's in there? Oh crap. No, let me out. Why is there water? Now I know there are enemies in these places. I don't think they do that to you in the first one though. Let's see. Do I need this? of enemies. There's one. I'm not sure what it can do. Oh, it can do that. Dang. Pretty sure a quick hits the eye would kill those in one shot. Not sure though. Yeah, so I haven't finished all the shrines in this game. I haven't... I haven't even destroyed Ganon yet, so... But I have gotten through a good bit of the game, so... Compared to Hollow Knight. This one's... Gonna be, um... I'm gonna know a lot more of what's happening. Traveler's Bow? I can't pick up any more though. Let me see. Drop on my Boko bows. Yeah. Surprise, sometimes he does that thing where he hits the chest and then he like hurts his foot. Maybe it depends on the chest. Hello. This is not a boss fight. Do not fear. This is the creator of the shrine. You have proven to possess the resolve of a true hero. I am this person, the creator of this trial. I never read these, so 
I am a humble monk, blessed with the sight of goddess Helia, and dedicated to helping those who seek yeah. With your arrival, my duty is now fulfilled. In the name of goddess Helia, allow me to bestow this gift upon you. Please accept the spirit orb. Nice. Spirit Orb, a symbol of courage given to those who have overcome the challenges of a shrine. May the goddess smile upon you. Pretty much every dialogue is like that in each of these shrines, so it's like the only time I'm gonna read it. Okay. <laughs> Where did you come from? It seems you've managed to get your hands on a spirit orb. Well done. How did you know? Hmm. Clairvoyance? A oh, hoe. Or perhaps it's something similar. Just something similar. As one gets older, it can become more difficult to see what it is. What is right before my, one's own eyes. Goodness sakes. However, that which was once hidden from view can often be crystal clear. But perhaps that is not true for everyone. Oh ho ho. The appearance of those towers and the awakening of this shrine. It's all connected to that Sheikah slate you carry on your hip there. What do you mean? <laughs> In real life, I'd probably just do this. <laughs> it has been quite some time since I have seen that Sheikah slate. Long ago, a highly advanced tribe known as the Sheikah inhabited these lands. The great power of their wisdom saved this kingdom time and time again. But their ancient technology disappeared long ago, or so it is said. It is interesting, however, to think how something like that survived all this time hidden away in a shrine. These shrines are tucked away in numerous places all across the land. On this plateau alone, I believe that there are th still three more. Bring me the treasure from each of those shrines and I will give you my paraglider. Yeah, that wasn't the deal. Oh, well I suppose I changed my mind. I'm sure that won't be a problem for a young go-getter like you. No. Since I'm feeling generous, I will also teach you a trick for f finding shrines. Hmm. Rhett. It's always best to survey the area by looking around from a high point. No way. How about you make your way to the top of that tower again? Are you joking? <laughs> I'm afraid not, but do not worry. I have another little trick to share with you for your effort. Take a look at the map on your Sheikah slate. Hmm. See those blue icons? You should recognize the cave where you woke. The shrine you came from and the, and the tower. You can travel instantly to any of those places with the Sheikah slate. Teleportation. Or so I heard quite some time ago. <laughs> I do not know if it actually works as such. Let's test it. How did you get up here? Hmm. I'm surprised it took you so long to catch up with an old man like me. Bleh. Did you fly here? Uh -huh. Oh ho ho ho. So you think an old man like me needs to fly to stay ahead of you? I still have a few tricks left in me. Now then. Uh. I wanted you to join me up here so you could use this as a vantage point to search for shrines. Did you know about the scope on your Sheikah sleep? Yes. Look through it, and you can stick a pin anywhere you'd like to mark on the map. Okay. 
The pins on your map serve as reference points for your travels. Just stick a pin anywhere you're interested in. How did you know? Oh, ho, ho, ho. Just a few tricks I've picked up after many, many years in the wild. You may take in my advice or leave it. Go ahead and take a look if you feel inclined to do so. Nice, nice. See your face? Whoa. <laughs> Just looking right at me. Where was that tower, uh, shrine? Wait. Oh, it's up there. So let's mark that. Where else? That one? And... I obviously got that one. Oh, there's one. Is it? I think so. Any more else? Oops. That one maybe? Okay. Well, see ya. I really like the sound effects. I'm not sure what kind of stones are used for these towers. It's meant to be like a mystery, but it sounds cool. Let's go here for where, the green marker. That's where we're headed first. so pretty. Oh dang. I'm gonna look at- hello. What is it? No, this- <laughs> gotta hit the heads. Okay. Now you. We can pick up each other's heads. Continue fighting. Oh. Why am I still locked onto that one? Is that all of them? Those are like night creatures. They always come at night. Obviously. Okay. Traveler spear. Oh. Oh. Ooh. I don't think I'll need this. Uh, actually. Let's get rid of this. Oh. It's like the same thing. But this is a lot faster. Still don't want to use it though. Yeah, let's do a travel sword. No, some of these are life. I'm gonna tell you that right now. It's not very easy to tell which ones, but I do have a bow, so if I need to, I can shoot them in the eye. If my aim is correct. Ancient spring. Let's just try- uh, There's bats. Keys. These are also a night thing, usually. Let's try and go around. Pretty sure that one's alive. Let's go around. Nice. We could just take care of them. You can see the different types of areas. Like volcano. Oh! See that? You see like palm trees over there? It's a good spot to get food. You can even see the tower. I'll definitely be getting that tower as soon as possible. There's that tower. I cheesed a lot of the towers in my last playthrough. We'll see if I actually do it this time. Is there one? I don't think so. Pretty sure there's one in here. 
it's not. Oh, there's these guys. No! It's a left trigger. Um, I'm gonna drop a Hoka Club. How do I drop this? Nice. Okay. Let's do this one. And I'll actually let this play through so you can see what it does. That's it. I tell me you're missing. <laughs> To you who sets foot in the shrine, I am this person in the name of Gosselia. I have heard this trial. Bomb trial. Bombs are pretty good in this game. My brother used him to like jump to places he wasn't supposed to. Stuff like that. Remote bomb. A bomb that can be detonated remotely. The force of the blast can be used to damage monsters or destroy objects. They are both round and cube bombs, so use whichever best fits the situation. Okay. So for this one... It left, yeah. We'll just drop it and detonate. Uh, de there. There's a timer for when you can use it again. Uh, this. Traveler's Claymore, nice. I got drop the Boca Bow. Throw. Uh, I do not want to use this right now. <laughs> I keep doing that. Is there something to fight up here? Okay, this is perfect for the cube bomb. Just drop it. Uh, uh, drop. Now. Bam. Ease. can load a circular bomb in here and then blow that up. Uh, you have to get used to these controls. Bam. Let's do one more. Gotta wait a minute. I can access that. But there's usually a chest in each of these. Which we kind of already got. But let's see. Oh yeah, there's one over here. I don't believe it's magnetic. Yeah, so. Let's unlock it. 
Snapping set up there. Pretty sure I can get one of these. I guess. Amper. Oh, I remember the ores in this game. I can love this game. So why is that ball jumping around? Well, nope. Calm down. Can I pick it up? No. There's no reason. Oh, just to show us that we can go in it. I see. How did I lose health? Where was that? I'm pretty sure I can explode this. Uh, oh, it's something I forgot at the other shrine. There's like a place where you can use your new power magnetism. Yeah. So we could head out that way, but that's a little bit dangerous. Let's head back this way. Actually, I can teleport to the... This one. It's something that's pretty OP in this game. You just teleport at any time, wherever you've unlocked. Let me first do this and I'll go back. What is that noise? It's daytime. Get out of here. Oh, right. They just drown. I can't even swim. I don't want another spear. I'm not much of a spear person. Okay. Let's use magnetism. Magnesis. To get this. In this. Nice, nice. Amber? Yep. The opal. Is there anything else? Why would you need that? Is there a bog around here? Is that a bog? That's why. Okay. Let's look at this chest unlocked. gonna be a perfect fit. Okay, test. Ice arrows, nice. And fire arrows. Man, I miss this game. I first played this game in 2020. Which is like super late. But, um. I believe I played it for about. maybe a year. Then I took a long break because I knew I wanted to record it and have a fresh mind with it. So it's so great to play again. Especially this being one of my favorite games. Okay, let's teleport to here. See if we can get any more chests. Okay, 
I have not fought one of these in a while, so I'm a little bit nervous. It's just one alive. Dink. Okay. I have a wall if I need it, so. Ooh, spooky scary. Nice. Hit an enemy's head. Yeah. I'm pretty sure I already got that. Dang. I do not do very much damage. Is it more damage if I do this? Not really. And it's dangerous. My arrows do nothing. I thought this would be so much easier. Turn around. Do I have a better bow? Because this is using so many arrows for it. This is my best bow. Oh goodness. Hi. <laughs> oh, it's done. I just wasted an arrow. Oh wait, no. I'm good. Look at all that. It's not necessary right now, but later on that'll be super good. Did I collect that arrow? No. Did it blow up? Darn. Okay, now let's collect this. Search. Ancient gear. Alright. Not sure how many more are alive. I could get out my claymore though. Now that one was mounted in the ground, if you couldn't tell, they have legs. And usually they can walk around, it's a lot more harder to defeat them. Okay, are you alive? Yes, you are. Hi. How did that feel? You try spinning. Spin! Spin! Spin right now! Stop. Mm -mm -mm -mm. Nope. Okay, that's gonna hurt. I remember there being way less time for that. Okay, shoot it again. Goes my traveler's claymore. Oh, go back. Just club. Freaking lock on. Pretty sure you can also parry these attacks with your shield. I never need to do that, so. If not. Gotta do that. Freaking arrow! not have a lot of arrows left, so I think I'm gonna go around more carefully and just run away from the other ones. It's not a very big area. Music. Yeah, I my family has been a long time Nintendo fan. So we've played a lot of uh, Legend of Zelda games. So it's very nostalgic for me. Enjoyed a lot. Okay. Oh. Let me go out here. Will this attack me? This one definitely not. Can I collect? There we go. Okay. I really thought there'd be chests. 
What the heck? Am I missing something? Will that one attack me? Do not know. Nothing. Oh dang, this spit the crap out of me. <laughs> oh, that was a waste of time. Okay, let's head to this one. Let's first teleport here to make it faster. Okay, straight this way. Do not want to fall in there. Is there a coral in here? Let me clank. Oh, I thought it was hollow. Usually they are. Is there anything magnetic? Oh, I'm off topic. This way. Camp there. Oh, and the old man. Look at the white flowers, so pretty. Nice. We're just gonna take these. This one's about to break. Well, well, well. So we meet again. What are you doing? Hmm. Can you not see that I'm hunting here? You'll scare off my prey like that. At least crouch down a bit. Okay. So I run around maniacally. M maniacally? I don't know. Mind if I take it? Oh, that's too far. Raw meat. Oh wait, I didn't finish my di dialogue. Oh, there's gotta be a Korok up here. Nope, just eggs. Still fine. Where is the old man? How am I lost? What? Where's the smoke? There. Hmm. hmm. What is it? What are you doing? Quiet, please. I'm still hunting. Got any tips? First, crouch down and approach your prey quietly to ensure you will not be noticed. When you're close enough, that Detection is nearly imminent. Im imminent. Draw your bow and let your arrow fly. Aim thoughtfully, and you should be able to take down your prey with a single arrow. Huh? Courageous one, I see you've taken possession of my old bow. Splendid. Now let's see what you can do with it. 
I'm rather tired, yes. I think I'm going to take a small break. It's probably Korok up there. Yep. He's getting so cute. Thanks. You can drop these on their heads, but it won't kill them. Okay. Now... Yellow. Probably Korok in here. Why do I have this up? Actually, yeah, I'm gonna use this up. These are a cork. I'm just gonna follow it. White one is the last one. Cute. how many Koroks are in the game, but I obviously have not gotten all of them. Dang. Nothing? Oh, at least I got a good. Don't you dare. No. We can stop hunting it. Use this. Let me just get. Dang. Ripped. <laughs> I forgot about the little horns. Oh, dang. I need more arrows. I'll just jump down there. That does not look safe. Will I die? Let's find out. No. Bruh. Is there three of them now? Dang. Hi. Hi. these arrows. So up here. What? Where'd it go? Dang, hold on. Oh, something break. Hey there. Where did I go? I'm getting used to the jump button because I immediately felt like flying there. My glider. Nice. Blue nightshade. Hmm. Pretty sure to safely do this. Dang! Oh, let me, uh... Sorry, don't do that in real life. Oh! Yeah. 
honeybees are good. Do not kill bees. Coarser bee honey. I know what that is. I don't believe... Well, I can try taking it out. When will it spawn? Oh, there we go. It's like a mini boss. Stone Talus. Just gotta get on its back. Climb. Let me climb, please. Let me climb. Can I climb? Just you gotta hit this. It's a weakness. Best music. No, let me hit. No. I can do a lot less damage than I remember. These things drop amazing amounts of loot. Pretty easy to fight. I'm gonna use all my weapons up and just fight. my spear. Oh. Yes, fall. Thank you. I don't know what to do if I run out of weapons. Dang, calm down. Who's trying to fight me? Dang. Oh, that was immediate death. <laughs> no, I was so close to killing it. Oh dang. Well, that's convenient. I just have everything back. This game is a lot more forgiving than I remember. Will those still come for me? Let's try not hitting them. See what happens. Uh, hi there. Wow. I didn't even have to kill them. I can't believe that. I'm so sorry. Are they going back to their hive? Oh. Okay. Well, that's a much better way of doing that. I clearly am not ready to take on the stone talus yet. Let me take it. Oh my goodness. Climb. There. So I'm gonna pause on that. When I have better weapons, I'll try again. Oh, I'm just about to reach the thing. But it does not look like the thing I thought. Oh, was I just looking at a campfire from the distance? That's annoying. Smell a shroom. Might as well take these guys out. Is there a chest? Yeah. There's a lot of them though. Hyrule herb. Do you see me? Dang. Yeah. Hope there's none walking around. probably fall asleep, which would make it a lot easier to take them out. Is that it? Okay. Mm-mm, mm-mm, nope. Stop, stop it. Alright, let me take out this bowman.
Dang, that'd be a headshot. Correct. Oh, he still got it though. Dang, here they come. Okay. Calm down. Too bad. Where'd that one go? Okay. Well, that was a waste. Good thing I have one over here. Pretty sure I need to use a sharp object to open those. Nope. Big object. <laughs> nice. I like how they glow in the night. Blue. What was it called? Can't remember. Let me see. Night shade. It's a lot more laggy than I remember. That's a main difference. Okay. Well, since there's nothing here. Oh. Let's first see what that is. Where's that campfire? Oh. I don't hear that piece of that. Or, uh, keys. Thanks. Dang. It's dangerous. Oh. <laughs> Get away. Give me that. Look back. Dang, it's so windy. Oh. Uh. I don't really want this, to be honest. Nice. The fire spreads so easily. It's kind of fine. Oh! Um. I don't have a glider yet. Bruh! <laughs> They're all scared of the fire, that's kind of funny. Oh my gosh. <laughs> that was so convenient. I've never seen them scared of fire. It's crazy. Let's take out this guy while I can. Come here. Dang, this one's kind of annoying. Nice. Oh, well that one was taken care of. Throw. No. Throw. Oh, it was just a bugger club. I'm an idiot. Nothing else?
so. What is it? Oh, that's a plot. Last place I died. Let's go here then. And head to those other shrines. 